Saudi Arabia, the region known for its futuristic mega projects, from building tallest structures to the world's fastest metro lines. The kingdom has announced the number of giga projects with a cost of over $1 trillion. But there are enormous doubts over these projects. Will the kingdom be able to push forward the construction of Neom or it will end up with costly mistake? Well, this is a detailed video of most ambitious and controversial project, Neom. Neom is a region in the northwest of Saudi Arabia with a total area of 26,500 km square. This economic model is almost the size of the Belgium which contains number of regions. It includes floating industrial complex, trade and tourist hubs, linear city and many more projects which will be discussed in this video. Saudi Arabia is the second most oil producer in the world and it became wealthy due to this substance. But the global demands of oil are now falling, as the countries are trying to shift towards cleaner energy technologies. All these factors force the government to create a singular mission to keep the kingdom thriving. This is known as Vision 2030. The initiative to create the city of Neom also emerged from this vision. That is a plan to reduce Saudi Arabia's dependence on oil, diversify its economy and develop public service sectors. On October 2017, Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Suleiman announced plans for the City of the Future Investment Initiative Conference in Saudi Arabia. This project is being owned and supported by Public Investment Fund. Overall, this project will be a symbol of progress and innovation, attracting global attention and investment as it shapes a brighter and more sustainable future. But what will be there? There will be an hexagon where a floating industrial complex where the advanced manufacturing will enable industries of the future. It covers roughly up to 97 square miles of the land which is approximately 15 square mile forms of the city. And there is the line that is 500 meters high, 200 meters wide and 170 kilometers long city in the area of Neom. In July 2022, the design of this line underwent some changes. Instead of having multiple buildings arranged in a straight line, the new design combined all of the buildings into a single structure. What is interesting is that entire structure is made up of glass meters. The modification gives the line a unique and futuristic look, reflecting its commitment to innovative design and creating an extraordinary cityscape which means no roads, no cars, carbon emission and everything its 9 million residents could ever need within 5 minutes walk. The whole city will be powered by clean energy. Trojana Trojana will be the first outdoor skiing destination in Saudi Arabia. It will be located about 50 kilometers from the Gulf of Aqaba coast with the Sarawat Mountains. Its elevation is ranging between 1500 to 2600 meters. What is interesting is that even though it is in the desert, the climate in this area is cooler than the rest of the Neom. There are many more projects like Neom Bay where developments were to include constructing the airports, even the Neom plans for 6500 hectares of the surrounding land to become agricultural fields and it also relies heavily on genetically engineered crops. Neom has $6.1 billion investment to build the world's largest green hydrogen plant to produce green ammonia to the scale by 2026. But why Neom? Saudi Arabia is launching futuristic projects because the world needs change. And that's why Neom means change. The people behind Neom have three important things in their mind. First, they want it to be a great place to live, with comfortable homes and good facilities. 
Second, they care about the environment, so they are focusing on being eco-friendly and using clean environmental energy and wind power. Finally, they want Neom to be the thriving place where people can find jobs and have businesses to grow. Saudi Arabia originally aimed to complete the major part of the project by 2020, with an expansion completed in 2025 but then fell behind the schedule. Last year, the drone footage was revealed showing the site preparation for the line taking place, while most of the project area remained bare desert. But Neom recently released a video showing the glimpses of the progress on the site. What we could see is that the construction work on the site has actually started. Excavators digging trenches in the desert and excavation had already started, reached quite far inland of about 20 kilometers. If we check the Google Maps, we can spot the several developments there in the whole area with the offices and the camps near the site. Major infrastructure projects like roads, utilities and hospitals are already there built in Neom. According to NEOM CEO, 20% of NEOM's infrastructure has been finished and remaining work is ongoing. As the construction grows over the period of time, the first element scheduled for the completion is luxury inland in 2024. Oxagon will follow shortly after that. With the first residents planned to move by 2024 and the onshore part of the city due to complete by 2030. The ski resort is set to open in 2026. The largest element of Neom, the line, will be rolled out between now and 2045. However, the Neom and the line in particular have been criticized for the expected 1.8 billion tons of embodied carbon associated with building of the project. On livability, Mohammed bin Salman stated that the line will challenge the traditional flat horizontal series and create a model for natural preservation and enhanced human life. The Saudi government has also been accused of forcibly displacing members of Hoytet tribe, who have lived for centuries in Tobuk province in northwest Saudi Arabia, to make way for the project. Well, if you like this video and want more details over this controversial project, let us know in the comment section. And apart from that, if you really liked it, then please don't forget to subscribe our channel for more interesting videos. Thanks for watching.